hidden away from bustling cities and the rapid pace of modern life lies Elmridge, a town forgotten by time. Maps after the 1940s never documented its existence, making it a mere footnote in history. I first stumbled upon Elmridge while hiking in the dense woods. Ancient gnarled trees gave way to a dilapidated entrance sign which only faintly read, Welcome to Elmridge. A shiver ran down my spine, not just from the cold, but the eerie silence that blanketed the area. The buildings looked as if they had been abandoned for centuries. Moss-covered rooftops, broken windows, and doors hanging by a single hinge painted a desolate picture. The odd thing was, amidst this decay, there was no sign of any life. No animals, no birds, not even the rustling of leaves. Drawn by a morbid curiosity, I ventured further. I noticed a church at the town center, its tall steeple piercing the overcast sky. As I approached, I could hear faint whispers, as if carried by the wind. The closer I got, the clearer they became. Leave. Get out. Too late. Inside the church, the air grew colder. On the pulpit, there was an old diary, dated 1875. Its pages documented the story of a once thriving community. But as I leafed through, mentions of a dark presence began to appear more frequently. The last entry was a hastily scribbled message. It's here. God help us. Suddenly, the church door slammed shut. The whispers grew louder, transforming into anguished cries. I tried to open the door, but it wouldn't budge. Panicking, I looked around for another exit. That's when I saw them, shadowy figures lining the church pews, eyes hollow and faces contorted in pain. One by one, they began to stand, pointing accusingly at me. The whispered chorus grew into a deafening roar. Why did you come? Just as quickly as the nightmare began, the pressure released. The church door swung open, and I stumbled out, gasping for breath. I ran without looking back until Elmridge was a distant memory, but the haunting whispers never left me. I later researched the area and discovered that Elmridge was abandoned after a mysterious plague wiped out its residents in 1875. No one knew where it came from or how it spread so rapidly. To this day, I can't explain what I experienced in that ghost town, but I know one thing. Some places are better left forgotten, and the voices of Elmridge? They'll always be with me, a chilling reminder of the town that time forgot.